Right, another handicap from Yarmouth. This one, a 0 to 90 handicap over 1 mile 5. One is Red Rover Patrick Hogan. Two, Smiling Success for Satyam. Three, Ballerina Queen for Martin Needham. Fourth, Glass Jaw, Alex Cherry. And Stu Gay has a lost two horses, Deputy Bill and Patch Patch. Only six horses go to the start here. And away they go. Very slow away was Patch Patch. Also, Glass Jaw got a slow start. But it's quickly up to lead is Red Rover from Smiling Success. Uh, on that one's outside Ballerina Queen. Travelling wide is uh, Patch Patch. Uh, Deputy Bill behind horses and Glass Jaw is just ahead of that. There's not much pace on, but now Red Rover takes it up for Patrick Hogan. Leads from in second Ballerina Queen. Then comes Smiling Success for Satya. Very similar colours the Satya and Patrick Hogan horses. Out wide, Glass Jaw in the orange cap and sleeves for Alex Cherry and the two Stu Grey horses look on from the rear. That's Patch Patch and Deputy Bill who has the rail. So Red Rover takes them along. Four lengths clear of Martin Needham's Ballerina Queen. Then comes Smiling Success on the inside of uh, Glass Jaw for Alex Cherry and Patch Patch just behind that and looking on from the rear is Deputy Bill. About eight lengths off this leader which is Red Rover. Travelling comfortably at front for Pat Patrick Hogan. Red Rover leads them from Ballerina Queen in second. Then comes Smiling Success on the inside. Uh, out wide, glass jaw for Alex Cherry. Patch patch behind that with Deputy Bill still on the rail. With eight points ever to travel as they go along the far side of the course. Red Rover the leader. Four lengths clear of the grey horse in the purple and white straps from Martin Eden. Ballerina Queen on that one's inside. Smiling success, the darker horse with the yellow colours. The orange leaves and cap of Alex Cherry's glass jaw. Just ahead of Patch Patch and on the rail is Deputy Bill for Stu Grey. At the rear of the field and in the slipstream of Smiling Success. So Red Red Rover trying to slow it up from the front and allows the pack to close the ground and Ballerina Queen and moves forward for Martin Needham on that one's inside smiling success so then comes a glass jaw for Alex Cherry now being pushed along to try and prove he's a deputy bull patch pad keeping that one in though and it's Red Rover still leads a compact field only five lengths first to last Red Rover from smiling success in second now the grey horse Ballerina Queen tries to move forward for Martin Needham patch patch is following that one deputy bulls up the inside and glass jaw just dropped to the back of the field. Three and a half furlongs left to travel. Still Red Rover leads, but here comes Smiling Success. Red Rover kicks again from the front. There wasn't much pace on, and Red Rover slowed it up and got some, got a breather before it turned turn for home, and Red Rover trying to stretch from the front. Yeah, Red Rover leads, four lengths clear. Ballerina Queen in second, who's finishing strongly. Pat getting going later up the outside. It's glass jaw. The two grey horses are with one pace back in the first and sex. It's still Red Rover in front. They're not making much, in back, back, much impression behind Red Rover. And Patrick Hogan's Red Rover's going to keep rolling now with a full to go. Glass Jaw is making an effort and so is smiling success, but it's still Red Rover in front for Patrick Hogan. And Red Rover hands and heels near the line. And Red Rover's going to win this very comfortably in the end from Glass Jaw. Finishing strongly now is Patch Patch. Red Rover wins comfortably. Patch Patch probably got second for Stu Gray. But the winner won with a lot in hand, you know, Fields. Jockey stopped riding a long way from home. Patrick Hogan gets a winner with Red Rover. Patch Patch did get second for Stu Gray. Ballerina Queen Martin even back in third. Deputy Bill for Stu Gray is back in fourth. And Smiling Success was first. And Glass Jaw never uh, came to follow through with that challenge back in sixth place.